Vitalism is an interesting understanding about how things are controlled, but the problem with the definition of vitalism from 1820 was it represented factors that were outside the range of physics and chemistry. So basically, uh, according to conventional science, vitalism was a metaphysical uh, character such as spirit or, or uh, ghosts or something like that. So conventional science was not really ready to grab on to the nature of vitalistic forces in controlling human life. And in fact, then they started to actually go the other way and look for the very physical mechanical forces. So we ended up with genes and biochemistry, except for the fact that uh, about uh, 1930, physics came in and started to recognize there was this invisible world that was actually controlling the physical world. And so what in 1820 was outside the range of conventional physics and science by 1930 started to come into our practical usage of quantum mechanics. So basically it says that uh, there are invisible forces or fields which are involved with shaping and controlling the activity of the physical realm.